Hey guys, it's your boy Arj, back with another issue of Quick No BS DBS News. This time with a new Dragon Ball Super episode 129 plot synopsis, straight from Fuji TV, courtesy of Herms98, and it gives some detail into what pushes Goku to master Ultra Instinct. But before we begin guys, don't forget to smash that subscribe button to enter our Xbox One X giveaway, as we now have only 5 days remaining until the winner is revealed. And our next giveaway then begins, which I can guarantee will excite a lot of you. But moving straight into the spoiler from Fuji TV, a preview for next episode airing March 3rd, Goku has once again unlocked Ultra Instinct. Neither he nor Jiren gives an inch as they battle while increasing their power. And amidst this, a new change comes over Goku. Now this is definitely interesting given we also know episode 129's title, Transcending the Limit, Mastering Ultra Instinct. Since what this plot synopsis details is that Goku for the first time in history is going to attain his new form through breaking the limit. When I talk about a new form, I'm talking about a legit new form we have never seen before, not adding Kaioken onto an existing one. Unlike when Goku achieves Super Saiyan through Rage, Super Saiyan 2 and Super Saiyan 3 via Otherworld training and God form through the help of fellow Saiyans, for the first time in his life Goku will be pushed to his actual limit of power in order to break through and gain the next stage. Where Ultra Instinct was achieved through breaking through the shell after losing all his energy, mastering Ultra Instinct will come from facing huge adversity. While still in Ultra Instinct and with some energy, Goku will be matched by a foe whose power will keep on rising. As I've mentioned so many times, as powerful as Goku can get, the limits of Jiren's power are never revealed. We know for sure that he has held back his strength all this time, capable of having eliminated everyone very early on if he really wanted to. So it's not even surprising that the synopsis of 129 details that Jiren's power carries on to increase throughout his fight with Goku once more. Jiren serves as the ultimate barrier of power, the ultimate wall to climb in order to surpass himself, and both Goku and Vegeta knew this. Vegeta was the first to achieve a new limit breaking form against Jiren and Goku is next up, except he will be achieving it while already in Ultra Instinct. It seems however that while in Ultra Instinct, Goku actually matches Jiren for at least a while, considering it says neither budges an inch. So it's very possible that the same thing that happened to Goku last time happens this time as well. That being Goku reaches his limit against Jiren. But whereas last time Goku just devolved back to base form, he won't have the same luxury this time as he and everyone knows that if he fails, it's the end of everyone. Gohan, Chi Chi, Goten and all his friends. From the looks of the preview, Jiren stands over a crater which we can assume he created after finishing Goku one of his most powerful attacks possibly a much more powerful version of the energy attack he used last time, saying just before he does it, his signature line, or Warida, aka it's over. With Goku in the huge crater and time still left on the clock, Jiren will walk down to dispose of the warrior, only for Goku to once more struggle and fight his way through breaking his final limit. A limit that comes close to killing him, turning his hair neon white as the pure energy runs through him in a moment which completely resembles a Super Saiyan 1 transformation. Up from the ground with a completely blank face, Goku will arise, whether he likes it or not, his body moving on its own as true Ultra Instinct should be, fighting using his will to survive and the will to save the universe only. Near the very end of the episode we will see the two clash, or a brief shot of the two just like the last episode, before we are left for the final two episodes of Dragon Ball Super, where we will see the long awaited battle between Mastered Ultra Instinct Goku and Jiren the Grey come to its startling conclusion. But yeah guys, that was today's Dragon Ball Super news update, complete with spoilers from Fuji TV. I feel your pain with there being no episode this week, but I really hope my delivery and quality of work whetted your appetite. And if you did like it, feel free to join the gang over here for more top quality Dragon Ball Super content every single day. Let me know down below exactly what your thoughts are on this information and the impending arrival of episode 129. But before you go guys, don't forget to smash that subscribe button as you only have 5 days left 
to enter yourself into our Xbox One X giveaway. One click for free and you're in. Get it done now. Until next video guys, cheers.